Rocket Girl and the Aliens, Episode 4 A Sticky Situation Roxy looked down. The purple slime made her feet stick to the streets. <laughs> Roxy, u- Roxy used her super strength. She pulled, heaved and twisted until sloop. Her feet came unstuck. By now the aliens had opened the the door of the pizza delivery truck. Yikes! The delivery, the deliv, the driver shouted, "Stop right here!" There, Roxy shouted as the as she flew towards the aliens. "I'm not going to let you hurt him. We aren't going to hurt anyone," said one alien. "My name is Brim." We need to refuel our spaceship. It runs on food, but none of this food is working. Why not? asked Roxy. It's not the right kind of food, said Brim. We need something really thick and gloopy. Thick and gloopy? said Roxy. Hmm, huh? said Mara. Uh, said Mara. I got sloppy joe on my sleeve. This is awful, said Jack. Just then, Brim and the other aliens walked into the cafeteria. Aliens! Someone shouted. Run for your life! Shouted someone else. Rocket Girl flew in. Don't panic, she said. These guys are friendly. They just need your sloppy joes so they can refuel their spaceship. Rocket God explained everything, and no one was scared anymore. Oh, you can have my sloppy joe, said Jack. Mine too, said Mara. Ma, take mine, said Terrell. Everybody grab your lunch and follow us, said Rocket God. Try it now, Brim, said Roxy. Brim started up the spaceship. It worked perfectly. Thank you, everyone, said Brim. Those sloppy joes are the perfect fuel for our spaceship. The kids waved goodbye as the spaceship flew away. I'm glad we got rid of those sloppy joes, said Terrell. But now what will we eat? Look out the window, said Mara. Pizza, said Jack. Mayor Bloom came into the cafeteria. He had a tall stack of pizza. Pizza, pizzas. Thanks for giving up your lunches to save Metro City, he said. I have pizza for everybody. The students cheered. A moment later, Roxy entered the cafeteria. Roxy, said Mara, you missed Rocket Gone and aliens, said Jack. What? asked Roxy, pretending to be surprised. Where were you? asked Ma- Mara. Oh, I was... Helping Principal Penn with office work, said Roxy. The Terrell looked at, at Roxy suspiciously. Well, you know that, you know why, Roxy. You know what, you know what, Roxy. You were wrong. Rocket God was able to save us from Sloppy Joe Day. Roxy didn't say anything. She just smiled and quietly reached for a slice of pizza.